So one of the most important things, especially when we're talking about inner ear weaknesses being a cause of dizziness or a vestibular disorder, is that when vestibular rehabilitation therapy is started, that it's being approached in kind of a three-pronged method or a three-pronged approach. So we kind of call it like our, our triangle of care. So at the tip of it, you're gonna have medical management, making sure that you're working with a proper specialist to truly verify that there is a vestibular disorder present and that there's not another cause of the dizziness and that that process is synced up with lifestyle modifications and then vestibular rehabilitation therapy. With the, the lifestyle modifications for a lot of people, some of the simple ones are going to be making sure that you're getting adequate rest, sleeping well at night, making sure that you're staying hydrated throughout the day, getting movement throughout the day, managing stress and anxiety, and identifying any additional triggers. So it's gonna make a big difference because as you go through the recovery process and the vestibular rehabilitation therapy starts, your body's able to actually receive it.